When I was six years old, I was diagnosed with a brain tumor. I was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. I have Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome. My body acts like I'm allergic to life. I was diagnosed with cancer, and I have had many complications, including not being able to eat for 18 months. I was born with a severe heart condition, and I was lucky enough to get two heart transplants. Having CP is something that you're born with and it just continues to exist throughout your life. I uh, found out that I had cancer on my 17th birthday. They found multiple brain tumors. I was diagnosed with bone cancer. I was born with cystic fibrosis. I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis at the age of 17 and a half. I had a germinoma brain tumor, lots of chemotherapy and a stem cell transplant. I wanted to be an astronaut. I wanted to be a firefighter like all kids. You know, you dream big. I wanted to be a professional hockey player. I was a competitive dancer as a kid. I was super into musical theater and singing and acting and all that fun stuff. And my dreams changed dramatically. I had a dream to become a doctor. I wanted to grow up like all my friends and get married and have a happy home. At the end of the day, everyone has a great potential to them and illness can't hold you back. And if it does, it's only because you're fooling yourself. And High Lifeline, Camp Simple is going to make you realize that. My lifeline had this mentality of just because you're in a wheelchair doesn't mean that you're any different. I really can do anything I want to. High Lifeline really enforces that nothing really stands in the way. I think that first summer in camp when I saw that there were other people who had gone through this and were able to still accomplish dreams and still do amazing things, I think that was to me the first time that I realized I can still accomplish my dreams. Camp Simcha definitely taught me that illness doesn't define you. We have no limits, nothing can get in our way, nothing can stop us. I'm not gonna give up on what I wanna do just because I was sick. Anything that you dreamed of, like your best dream ever, that's what Camp Simcha is, and that's what High Lifeline is, and it's, I just love, I just love it. Just, it's hard to put into words. I feel like I can accomplish anything and be anything I wanna be. I am now currently um, in Baruch College studying public affairs. I am married for over six years and I have twin daughters that are four years old. I have a great job and life is really good. I wrote a children's book and it was published. I'm the founder of the Sick Chick Network. One of my biggest dream was to get married. Thank God this past year I was able to get married. I'm currently a resident uh, in oral surgery at LIJ and at Stony Brook. You know, I'm doing something that I find incredibly rewarding and I'm helping people on a daily basis. High Lifeline was very involved with me and my life. After going through that experience, it inspired me to become a nurse. I started graduate school, I got a doctorate in psychology, and I am now the Director of Clinical and Family Services at High Lifeline, and I'm married and I'm living my dream. I will be a lawyer and go into American politics and impact meaningful change throughout society. My dream is to be an actress and or a singer-songwriter. I want to be a nurse. I want to be an oncologist. I will be a sports agent when I get older. When I grow up, I want to be an artist. I'm going to be a paleontologist when I grow up. I want to be a fire truck. When I grow up, I'm going to be a football player. I want to win the Nobel Prize for medicine. It also pays pretty well. <laughs> I will be a great husband. I want to be a child life specialist. I will be a social worker and a damn good one. I want to be a doctor. I want to be a father. I want to be involved in the community. I want to be the president of the United States, to be honest. And maybe one day I'll actually get there. I will be the CEO of High Lifeline. You know what? I don't care if the odds are against me. And I don't care if I'm going to have to work hard, because I've seen that we can have success. And I want to go for that success.